Introduction Europe is the sixth largest continent in the world. In the past, the Europeans explored, discovered and colonized places in almost every continent. They have influenced and in the past, scientifical and technical advancement added luxury within society and turned the world into a global village. Europe is responsible for a lot of progress made by the world during the past 300 years in various scientific and technological developments. Location The continent of Europe lies entirely in the northern hemisphere extending between 35 degree north and 75 degree north latitudes and 10 degree west and 60 degree east longitudes. The prime meridian or the zero degree longitude passes through the western part of Europe. It passes through Greenwich near London, which is a part of the United Kingdom. In terms of area, it is only larger than Australia and ranks sixth among all the continents. Europe and Asia together form Eurasia. Europe occupies only one-fourth of Eurasia. Boundaries Europe is bounded by water bodies on three sides and thus forms a peninsula extending westwards. It is bounded by Arctic Ocean in the north, the Atlantic Ocean lies to its west and the Mediterranean Sea towards its south. The continent of Europe is separated from Asia by the Ural Mountains, the Caspian Sea and the Caucasus Mountains. The Strait of Gibraltar separates it from Africa. The coastline is indented and has a number of gulfs, bays and enclosed seas. Some bays, gulfs and seas that border the continent include Bay of Biscay, Bay of San Sebastian, Gulf of Bothnia, Gulf of Lyons, Gulf of Finland, White Sea, Baltic Sea, North Sea, Adriatic Sea and Aegean Sea. Political Divisions Although Europe ranks sixth among the continents of the world in terms of its area, the continent is divided into a large number of countries. Some of these countries have been grouped together and are referred to as follows. The Balkan States, the Baltic States, the Lowland Countries, West European Countries, Central European Countries, Scandinavian Countries, Iberian Peninsula. The Balkan States Albania, Bosnia and Herzegovina, Bulgaria, Greece, Croatia, Macedonia, Montenegro, Slovenia and Siberia are the countries that lie within the Balkan Peninsula and are commonly known as Balkan States. The Baltic States Countries like Estonia, Latvia and Lithuania that lie along the Baltic coast are known as Baltic States. The Lowland Countries Countries of Belgium, Netherlands and Luxembourg are a part of the Lowland area of Europe, hence these countries are called Lowland Countries. Together they are known as Benelux. This name is derived from a part of the name of the country that is B for Belgium, N for Netherlands and Lux for Luxembourg. West European Countries Lowland countries and the countries of France, UK and Ireland are together called the West European countries. Central European countries Austria, Czech Republic, Germany, Hungary, Liechtenstein, Poland, Switzerland and Slovakia are called the Central European countries. Scandinavian countries Denmark, Norway and Sweden are called Scandinavian countries. Iberian Peninsula. It includes Spain, Portugal and Andorra. Some other major countries. Russia, which is the largest part of Europe, is one among the 15 independent republics into which the former USSR had been divided. Armenia, Azerbaijan, Belarus, Estonia, Georgia, Latvia, Lithuania, Moldova and Ukraine are the other independent republics of the former USSR 
that lie in Europe. The rest five are a part of Asia. Vatican City, the headquarter of the Roman Catholic Church and the smallest country in the world, also lies in Europe. Physical Features Although not a very large continent, Europe has a variety of physical features. Mountains lying towards northwest and south with plains between them. There are plateaus lying in the southern part and also a part of river basins. Broadly, the physical features of Europe can be divided into four main groups. The Northwestern Highlands, the North European Plains, the Central Uplands, the Alpine Mountain System. The Northwestern Highlands Extending from Finland, Sweden, Norway up to the British Isles and as far as Iceland are the Northwestern Highlands. They are one of the oldest mountains of Europe formed by hard-aged rock. As a result of weathering and glacial erosion, these are not very high and have gentle slopes. However, along the Atlantic coast where these highlands end up into the sea, the valleys form long and steep-sided narrow inlets. These valleys which are shaped by the glaciers are known as shores and are occupied by the ocean water. These shores make the coastline indented and rugged. Jolin Mountains belong to this physical division. The North European Plains These plains lie between the rural mountains in the east to the Atlantic Ocean in the west. Towards the north of these mountains are the Northwestern Highlands. To their northwest, they are bordered by the North Sea and the Baltic Sea. They are broadest towards the east and taper westwards almost forming a triangular shape. These plains are not very undulating and not higher than 300 meters above the mean sea level. Almost flat and gently sloping plains, these are washed by the waters of several rivers. The rivers crossing these plains include the Volga, which is the longest river, the Rhine, the Seine, the Danube, the Dnieper, the Don, the Vistula and the Elbe, etc. Along with the large northwestern plains, the other plains that lie in Europe include the Hungarian plains, the Lombardy plains in Italy and the plains of Andalusia in Spain. The Central Uplands This physical division lies between the North European plains in the north and the Alpine mountain system in the south. These uplands are about 1600 meter high above the mean sea level. This region is covered by plateaus, mountains and seas. The central, massive and the vosges in France, the Spanish Meseta, the Bohemian Plateau, the Black Forest and Harz Mountains in Germany and the Ardennes in Belgium are a part of the central upland region. Along with the Ural Mountains, these uplands are thought to be part of the Hercynian system. The Alpine Mountain System The Alpine Mountain System or the Alpine Mountains are the southernmost among the physical division of Europe. The natural region stretches between the central uplands in the north and the Mediterranean Sea in the south. The Alpine Mountain System is formed by a series of young fold mountain ranges running parallel to each other. The mountains consist of several high steep sloped peaks and deep valleys. The Alps form the central portion of this mountain system that stretches from the Atlantic Ocean in the west to the Caspian Sea in the east. The Alpine mountains traverse through several European countries which include France, Spain, Italy, Switzerland, Slovakia, Poland, Ukraine, Romania, etc. Along with the Alps, the mountain ranges that are a part of the Alpine system are the Carpathians that lie in the northwest of the Black Sea extend through Romania, Ukraine, Slovakia and Poland. The Transylvanian Alps also form a part of Romania. The Balkan mountains lie to the north of the Black Sea extend in the lands of Yugoslavia and Bulgaria. 
the Julian Alps, the Dinaric Alps, and the Pindus Mountains stretch from the Alps in the north to the land of Greece, the south up to the Mediterranean Sea. The Alpenines also stretch from the arc of the Alps in the north to the Mediterranean Sea. It extends over the whole of Italy in a north-south direction. The Pyrenees form a natural boundary between the countries of France and Spain. The Caucasus Mountains that lie between the Black Sea and the Caspian Sea form a boundary between Asia and Europe. The Sierra Nevada Mountains lie in the southern part of Spain and the Cantabrian in northern Spain. Mount Elbrus, about 5,633 meter high, is the highest peak in Europe. It lies in the Caucasus Mountains. Mount Blanc, 4,810 meters, is however the highest peak of the Alps. Mount Etna and Mount Vesuvius are the two well-known volcanic peaks of the Alpine system. The eruptions in these volcanoes are a proof of the mountain building activity that is still in progress in this mountain system.